We will be asking people about images such as of young people playing underage games? I think it's really bad because they put an age in it for a reason because it's not good for their minds because their minds aren't like fully developed for the game. So I don't think it's good. Do you think that violent games can change the way a kid acts or their behaviour and why? Definitely because they see these violent games and although they might not consciously think it's real, subconsciously they do and they become more violent and like talking to parents they become rude with friends they get violent and it's not good, you know? Yeah. Who would you blame the most? The parents, the kids, the games or the people who make the games? The parents because they should be like having a close eye on them. There is a reason why they put 18 or 15 because it's not good for their child. So if they do it then they're putting their child at risk mentally. Do you think that games can become a reality? In a way, yes, because some people, not everyone, I'm not going to lie, but some people, they just take it to the extreme, they think it's like reality, and someone jokes with them and they think they need to beat them up, calls them, you know, these names, they're like, oh no, this beat you up, you know what I mean? So it's not, yeah. Thank you. It's good. <laughs> what do you think of playing underage games? It's fine. Not really. First of all, it doesn't do anything, just playing the game. It's not real life. Do you think it changes the way they act or their behaviour? A bit. Not much though. What do you think of young people playing on the race game? It's absolutely... Look, look at what it is. <laughs> it's pathetic. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> Catch you all. Anyway, carry on. Who do you think is more to blame? The parents, the kids, the game, or the people who make the game? The rapists. The rapists. <laughs> Because they like, they're just sexual deviants. <laughs> I wish they would all die. Yeah. Do you think games can become reality? No. No. Well, well, well. It's, there's no games about raping people. So. <laughs> what about violent games? Like war games. And... Help I, me. I, I actually beat a lot of people up, so yeah, I think it's going to come true. Okay, thank you. What do you think of young people playing underage games? Uh, I think that the. The age restrictions on games are there for a reason. Uh, they're there because the material is not suitable for people under that age. So I don't agree with kids playing games that have a rating older than that. Do you think that violent games can change the way a child acts? Uh, I don't think it can change the way a child acts, but I think if there's existing issues with behaviour or mental stability, then these kinds of games can exacerbate that. Who would you blame the most? parents, the kids, the games, or the people who that make the games? Uh, if the kids are under 16, then ultimately the parents are in charge. So it's the parents' responsibility to not to let them play games that are above their age limit. Do you think that games can become reality? I think games will predict future social events and developments. So I don't think they become reality. I think it's more of a prediction of what will happen in the future.